Patty Fernandez and I'm an art teacher. Visit my website at pattyfernandezartist.com. Okay, let's draw. Today's project is how to draw a hippo. I'm going to start right here about halfway on my paper and I'm going to draw a wavy, 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 wavy line all the way across. I come back to the left and I'm going to draw a curved line up, 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 all the way across. I'm going to come back down and draw another wavy, 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 wavy line all the way across. And if you have room, you can put one more curved line up, 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 across. Right in the center, I'm going to draw a little curved line up, over, connect. On the left hand side, I draw a little curved line up, over. On the right hand side, a little curved line up, over. And I'm going to mimic the line, little curved line on the left, little curved line on the right. I come back to the left and I draw a big curved line all the way across, connect, and right in the center I'm going to just draw a little curved line. I come down and I draw one dot, two dots, and now I'm ready to color. I'm going to color the inside of this space pink. And if you have a gray crayon, you can color the body part right here, the outside of the ears right here, and color in the face also with gray. And then with my blues, I'm going to do dark blue all the way across. In an ABAB pattern, now I'm going to do my blue green or turquoise all the way across and then repeat. So I'm doing my water with the blue, dark blue, and blue green. Okay, let's see what it looks like all colored in. Here's my hippo all colored in saying hello from the water of the river. Okay, bye-bye.